Chris Chan has made countless custom Pokemon cards. A lot of people think that Chris Chan is not creative, but I beg to differ. I mean, when someone can create this many Pokemon cards, this is not even all of them. That takes creativity, man. And that people can say that he's copying um, Pokemon, right? But look, you got, what is Christian Chandler card? Custom. Purely custom. Got the heart fix. Got the lonesome punch. If Christian has more than 50 damage on him, the attack does 30 extra damage. This is some cool stuff, man. We're learning all about it today on Starship Lockjaw. <laughs> Lockjaw, baby. Come get your love. Serve us your daddy, baby. Welcome back to Starship Lockjaw, your daily source for internet subculture. Hey, my friends, today we're learning all about the Wall of Originals, all right? This is uh, Chris Chan's custom Pokemon cards. He had the Wall of Originals. It covered an entire wall in his room, all right? Really good stuff. After we read a little bit about the Wall of Originals, we're actually going to be, um, we're going to be looking at each card individually and uh, analyzing it. So this video is going to be a little different than usual, but I know some of you will like it. Hell yeah. Hey, if this is your first time around here, you like this kind of stuff, consider subscribing. Already subscribed with the notification bell on. Hit the thumbs up and we'll get rocking and rolling. All right, um, let's begin here. So, the Wall of Originals was a large wall showing Christian Weston Chandler's customized Pokemon cards. Uh, they hung from one of the walls in one of his rooms. So, the lighting in several of his videos suggested that the sheet was covering a window. But other pictures showed that this was probably not the case. Okay, let me blow up that picture for us here so we can see what it looks like. Uh, does it look like there's a window behind? He does have some light coming through behind those cards right there. Man, look at all Christian's stuff. It's cool, man. Remember those speakers with the back in the day, man? That was in the... That was the early 2000s. Late 90s, early 2000s. Look at that. Man, Christian's doing it, baby. I wonder if there was a window there. Anyways. Some people speculate that the absence of the wall and the pictures indicated that it had been removed. Whether, uh, whether this was meant to be permanent or temporary is unclear. Now in July, he revealed that at least three cards survived the Chandler house fire. In June 2018, more cards resurfaced when he sold nine of them on eBay for $100. Was that $100 each or $100 for the pack of nine? I mean, hey, $100 for a pack of nine, that's a heck of a deal right there, man. Let's blow this picture up, too. What are we talking about, baby? Look at this. Oh, man, a Metonic. Ooh, nice. This is some cool stuff, man. Shining Sonichu. Ooh, this is really cool. So he he made it, and he printed it out, and he glued it on there or something? Sonichu. Ooh, that one's holographic. Dang, brother. Look at that. Did somebody say Sonichu? What's up, Sonichu? Hey, Shaman. Oh, hell yeah. You ain't kidding, brother. Man, you ain't kidding. We'll, we'll, we'll talk later, Sonichu. We'll talk later. All right, nice. Man, that's a cool card, man. It's holographic, too. I want to make some Pokemon cards. All right, things to note. There are several interesting trends which emerge when one takes in all of Chris's cards. They provide some insight into his game design process, which further support the traits that Chris featured on, some, on the quickie. Uh, some interesting notes about the cards include the earlier cards that feature Chris. They depict himself, so he's got himself in the earlier cards. That's cool, man. Insert yourself into your work. That's awesome. Note the first appearance of a girl alternative for Pikachu, dubbed Chikachu, Chica, Chica, who can only deal damage when accompanied by a boyfriend. Oh, so that's kind of, oh yeah, I don't know about that, man. That'll get you in trouble nowadays. Saying she needs to have that boyfriend so that she can be uh, effective on the on the battle scene. Okay, Plautistic. Who is it? it is a plant that is, aut okay, of course, of course. Okay, Chris shows up as a trainer and a gym leader, as well as a Pokemon. In each of these identities, Chris has multiple forms and personas. This trend is totally in line with Christian's theme of acquiring powers. He has created himself as a normal type, in which he is depicted as a Pokemon. Many of his handmade cards have synergistic effects or several complementary effects at once. This allows Chris to pull off combos with only one or two cards. According to field reports about his card game technique, Chris would need these hugely layered card effects because his deck building skills were rather poor. So they're saying he just wasn't very, they're saying he wasn't really that good when he played Pokemon, building decks and things like that. But, uh, I beg to differ, man. He taught those kids a lesson at Game Place when they played Pokemon. Despite spending considerable time on them, Chris did not try to use these cards in official games at the Game Place. 
Hey, imagine if he had tried to use those cards at the game place. Like, you can't use those, right? Yes, I can. <laughs> you ain't gonna stop me. Uh, some of the cards that are based on pre-existing Pokemon, such as Blue, Donphan, and Togepi, were most likely made in a response to early Generation 2 Pokemon revealings. The Yoshi and Luigi cards... Hold on, Yoshi and Luigi? Oh, come on, baby, that's Nintendo. We're kind of mixing up... Well, there was Pokemon and Nintendo stuff. Uh, Super Smash Brothers, man. We can mix it up. Super Smash mixed it up, you guys. Come on, baby. Uh, obviously, fake Nintendo Power April Fool's Day joke. Haven't learned about that one yet. We'll do that in an upcoming video. Chris produced at least three holographic cards using aluminum foil for the shiny component. He did. He really did. Man, so here's the wall of originals. We're going to be looking at the wall of originals now. We're actually going to go in here and take a look at a few of these. Uh, I want to review them. I want to I want to learn this stuff, man. I've been excited about this for a while. Before we do that, I have something very important to show you guys. Check this out. We've been learning a lot about the Doomers, right? We've been learning a lot of... Now, check it out. Certified Doomer apparel. Check it out, babe. We got all kinds of Doomer stuff, man. We got shirts, pillows, mugs, sweaters, long sleeve, everything. All kinds of stuff, babe. We got phone. We got phone cases, man. If you're a certified Doomer, you want to rep that certified Doomer lifestyle, do it, baby. Link is in the description. Bayshaman.com slash merch. Of course, we've also got all of our Chad apparel. We've got Tyrone, certified Tyrone. Everything, man. If we talk about it around here, you're going to find it over there. All kinds of cool stuff. All right, you'll find something you like. Hey. All right, you guys. Plugged the new merch. Let's keep rocking, baby. Let's do it. So, our first Pokemon here that we're looking at <laughs> that's Luigi. That's Luigi. Hold on, let's go in here. Um, Luigi. All right, that's Luigi. Wrench does 20 damage. Ha, water, wave, something else. Luigi. Okay, I like the Luigi. Let's let's do another one here. Um. Okay. Yeah. Where were we at here? We're gonna have to. We're gonna have to fix this. Let's let's go. There we go. Okay. Uh, we have next Pokemon. We have. Ah, we have, uh, who is this? <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. He's like, it's like a little sombrero hat, huh? Is that a little hat? Basic Pokemon something. Espanyo Compassion. Espanyo Compassion is the attack. Nice. Wow. All right. He only does 10 damage, though. Yeah, he looks like a little Weedle. Remember Weedle? Pokemon Weedle? Uh, is this the same card right here? Yo, that's the same card. Espanol, Espanolic. Oh, his name is Espanolic. Espanol Confusion. This is an updated version of the other one we just looked at. Espanol Confusion. Or is he the evolved version of the other one? Espanolic. That's awesome. Okay, let's go to you. This is a, this is adorable, man. That's an adorable card, man. Yeah, he gives Weedle a run for his money. Uh, Vagiton. Va <laughs> Vagiton, what? <laughs> nice, baby. Nice. I like it. I dig it. He no, he is the evolved version of Espanolic. Look at him. He's the evolved version. Wait, he's the third version. The first one was first. He's the second. And there's a, like Bulbasaur, Abasaur, Venusaur. Oh right, yeah, man, you ain't kidding. All right, well, what else do we have? I got you. I got you. So that's the ev evolution. And what is this one? <laughs> no, because <laughs> they're just different versions of the same card. Like I think I got it figured out. But then it turns out, no, I was wrong. We got Razor Leaf, Spanish Fly. That's Vagiton too. So that's, I guess they're just different versions of the same card. That's what's going on here. I'm extremely confused in case you can't tell. Thumbs up the video right now for being confused. Um, all right. Uh, basic Pokemon. Uh, does that say Gray uh, Bike? Bike? Bray? I don't... Bray? I'm not quite sure. I can't read it. But... um. Looks like a little purplish looking dog. He looks like a cool dog, man. He looks pretty sweet. I like it. Yeah, I like purple. I like purple. You like purple? Who's your favorite Pokemon? Leave me a comment right now telling me your favorite Pokemon. I want to know. I want to know. Uh, alright. Now this Pokemon looks really familiar. That, that is a Pokemon. I remember him. He was one of the new ones, so I didn't care for him. I never liked any of the new Pokemon. If they weren't my original 151, they don't count to me. But I remember Pokemon look just like him later on, man. All those fake ones. They're not real. They're not true and honest, right? After 151 Pokemon, man. Those new generations. Worse than when they... Uh, Power Rangers. When the new Power Rangers. Power Rangers lost in the jungle. I'm like, what are you talking about? Yeah. But yeah, anyways. Um, what? Hmm. 
What's his name? Can't, I can't read it. Oh, wait, wait. It, Baniru. Baniru is his name. I see it on the top up here. It actually shows me on the tab when you click the tab. Okay, okay. So then can I go back to my first Pokemon here? And his name is actually... His name was Espan. Okay, Espan. Espan, Espanola, Espan, and then Vagerton. Okay, cool. Okay, what else we got? Um, let's do this one. Togepi. <laughs> Hold on. I know. Togepi is a Pokemon. So, hold on. I mean, it's a, it's a cool card. It's a completely custom Togepi. But, uh, I mean, I thought I thought Christian made up all these new Pokemon. Hold on, let's continue. May I, oh, okay. There must have been a few that were actually Pokemon that he just created his own cards for. That must have been what happened. Okay. And Dict. This one's name is D-H-C-T. Dict. 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 <laughs> his name is Dict. <laughs> <laughs> duck, duck, duck. All right. Uh, okay. His his move is called Broken Stick. It does thirty damage. Nice. Pretty cool, huh? I like it. Duck. <laughs> duck. I choose you. <laughs> yeah. Awesome. Missin Gif. All right. Missin. Um. His name is Missin. <laughs> what is he? That's why you got the question marks, baby. It's like, what is he? We don't know. We don't know whatever he is he's missing and he got that question mark like what he can use a water gun <laughs> or a sky attack <laughs> i think it's like the pokemon is missing you don't know which pokemon is that? that's missing he's missing we don't know where he's at <laughs> i think that's 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 good dude dude thumbs up the video for missing oh that's golden all right let's continue let's continue oh that's awesome dude that's awesome missing i love that so much uh, then we got Bush. Hey, Bush. <laughs> you gotta do something about that. But <laughs> Alright, Bush. So, he can do the Vine Whip move, which does 30 damage. Alright, nice. Very cool. He's a basic Pokemon. So, he got 90 HP. Nice. He's a power hit. Power, man. He got 90 HP. Man, remember that Charizard? Damn, Charizard has some, Charizard has some HP, brother. Man. Let's see what else we got here. We have Bushwhacked. Dude, you look like... Who's he look like? A Machamp? Machop? Machop? If I remember correctly. He's got 90 HP too. You strong, boy. Look at him. He's like, come on. Let's do it. Man. Uh, he's got that aesthetic too. Look at the, the material he's made of. He does Stun Spore, which is 20 damage Vine Whip. Ah, very cool. Very cool. Hey, man, he's shaped like Machamp. Or Machop. Machop, right? <laughs> he must have been based on him hardcore. All right, we got Coffin. Coffin. You look like a little dinosaur, brother. What's up, Coffin? Hey, he look kind of like Sonichu. He's like Sonichu's cousin that lives down south, brother. Hell yeah. Man, you ain't can. He does dizzy, dizzy punch. So he gets real dizzy. Dizzy punch. He's got 90 HP as well. A lot of these folks have 90 HP. They're powerful, man. Powerful. I like it. All right, that's Coffin. Uh, okay, here we have Coffin Grew. Oh, Coffin. Coffin Grew. He's bigger now. He evolved. All right, Coffin Grew. I like it. I like it. Dizzy Punch. He does Dizzy Punch, too. And he's got the same HP and the same... If he's the evol... Oh, it, just, it must be a new version. That's what it is. It is a new version of the same card. It's an updated version. That's what it is. Cool. Uh, here we have... Drum. <laughs> we have Drum. Hey, he's a drum, man. Play him. Boom, 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 boom. Drum. His move is Sonic Boom Docks. It's 20, does 20 damage. He's only got 50 HP, so Drum, you're not that powerful, Drum. You're not as powerful as the others are. Yeah, you're doing it, though. You're trying to, baby. You're trying to. And here's the updated Drum cart. Oh, Drum more. Okay, so Drum, oh, Drum and more. He evolved, baby. I like it. Sonic, boom. Uh, do not apply weakness and resistance for this attack. Nice. He got the same HP, though. When you evolve, aren't you supposed to have more HP? I don't, I don't remember, man. I mean, you're supposed to. Sim. We got Sim. Ah, he turns into a symbol. Or is it a different Pokemon entirely? He's got 90 HP. Oh, Christian loves giving that 90 HP, baby. He's got a hard clash. <coughs> Sim. He's a symbol. That's nice. I like that one. Uh, and then his, here's a newer updated... Oh, Symbolic. He evolved to Symbolic. 90 HP. 40. Nice. God, are they evolving or are they just updated versions? They have different names. They have to be evolved, but they have the same HP. I'm so confused. I want to know. I want help me understand. Leave me a comment. Explain it, please. 
All right. Okay. Flash B. Oh, uh, Flash. Flash B. His name is Flash B. Flash B. Okay. He's like a little bug with a little flashlight on him. Nice. These are those guys that'll be in the forest when you first start the game and you keep getting them over and over, like Weedles. Oh man, Weedle. Uh. Then we have the updated version of that card, Flash Bulb. Are you evolving? Or did you just change the name? I just can't get over this. I can't get over this. I don't know. I don't know if they're evolving or just a name change. It must be they're ch changing the name of the Pokemon and creating a new card. That's what it is. That has to be what it is. That just has to be what it is. It's the only thing that makes sense. And then we got the Coon. <laughs> nice. All right. The Coon Bulb. Coon Bulb. 70 HP. He gave him 70 HP. Electric Jolt. 20. Not good enough for he's not good enough for the 90, brother. He's not good enough for the 90. Alright, uh, did we hold on? Did we see this one? The Coon Bulb. This is the updated version. 80. He's got 80 HP. We got bugs. Oh. You look like Butterfree. He looks like Butterfree. Nice. Alright, bugs. We got bugs. Pokemon, man. He's got 90 HP. How does everybody have 90 HP, brother? You get heading out that 90 HP, man. 90 HP wasn't no joke back in the day. When they had newer Pokemon, was it like common to have 90 HP? Back in the day, man. Back in the day, you had a good card if you had 90 HP. Um, so we already looked at these. These are the Coon and the Coon Bulb. And then we looked at the Butterfreeze. Uh, okay, let's go to our third row. Third row. Next up, we've got Christian's Flash Bulb. Oh, Christian's Flash Bulb. Only gave him 40 HP? Oh, come on, baby. Give him some more HP. Man, these cards are good. These cards are just cool, man. Thundershock or Leech Life 1010. Yeah, kind of. Okay, let's see. Does he evolve? Does he evolve? Uh, Christian's Coon Bulb. There we go. Nice. Christian got a Coon Bulb, baby. Man. Uh, let's see what else. Next up, we've got Christian's Bug Zap. Who does he look like? Does he look like... Not Zubat. He doesn't really look like Zubat. I think Butterfree again. He kind of reminds me of Butterfree. Christian's Bug Zap. Yeah, he's got 80 HP. Man, that bug looks too little to have 80 HP. He's got 80 HP. I guess he does. Nice. Bug Zap. Uh, here we've got... Wheeler. Oh, so he's a wheel. That looks like an electrode with a wheel around him. A tire around him, bro. Look at that. Look at that. Wheeler. Nice. Rattling, rack, rattling tackle. I like it though. Wheeler. That's a really good one. They should have had one in the original. They should have thought of that, but they didn't. But Chris Chan did. Wheeler. That was a good one. Man. Wheeler. Any rolls. Remember the Wheelers on uh, Return to Oz? Oh, that, movie, that movie terrified me as a child. It ruined my part of my life. Okay, let's continue. Here's the evolved version. Wheeler. Okay, it's just the updated version. Cool. Now we got this one. Uh, Hotfin. Ooh, Hotfin leading the way. He's got 60 HP, 20 damage for his agility move, and then he's got the fin slap. Is that fin slap? Uh -huh. He looks pretty cool, dude. That's a good design. He's like a little boxy car with wheels on. <sighs> Hotfin, I choose you. Go, Hotfin. Uh, is this an evolver? Hot finish. Ah, he evolved. Hot finish. Got 60 HP, Fin Slap does 20, Agility does 30, Hot Finish. Man, is it just me or like, hold on here. Okay. Hot Fin, wait, no, that's the same, Hot Finish, Hot Finish, and Hot Finish. They're both named Hot Finish. Have I been reading the wrong names this whole time? This is so much harder than you think it is. All right, we have, uh, Stuggerter. His name is Stutter. No, his name is Stress Tire. Stress Tire. I've been reading the names for the, the files that these people created. Sometimes they use the real name. Other times they use stupid things like Stutter. My goodness. Stress Tire. His name's Stress Tire. He's strong. He looks cool, man. He's got gains. Hell yeah, he's doing it, baby. Tire punch! Nice. Stress tire. Okay. Let's continue here. Uh, let's finish this up. We've got... Strong tire. Oh, so he evolves and becomes strong tire. 
Is he holographic? I think he might be holographic. He's got 90 HP. Nice. Nice. All right. Um, okay. Strong tire. And was that this one? Strong tire. And then what do we have here? Strong tire two. Strong tire. Just another strong tire. I mean, it's cool though. I like it. I like the color too. <laughs> Very good. Nice. Um, and we got this one. We've got Christian's Wheeler. Christian's Wheeler. He's doing his thing, man. He's doing his thing. I like it. I like it. Christian's Wheeler. So he's got multiple versions here. Yeah, yeah. He made multiple versions of the same ones. I like it. And then Christian's Hot Finish. Nice. That looks good. That looks very good. I like it. I like it a lot. Let me see here. Um, man, I tell you, there are a lot of these. There are a lot of these different Pokemon. We've looked at three rows. If you think we should look at more of the rows let me know i don't know if y'all will enjoy this i like it. i think i like and enjoy it let me know if you think you enjoy it or not and uh maybe we can do more hey before we wrap this up i really really want to thank everybody who loves this content and actually supports the channel over on patreon i thank you guys so much youtube's been coming after me again man uh, but you guys help me out a lot so i appreciate you so much i thank you so much uh if you love the content consider supporting us over there Hell yeah. Or just go check out the new merch, baby. Link is in the description. Drop me a thumbs up before you leave. And I'll see you very, very soon.